Hey guys, what's happening? So, I've been using this Eson filament for a couple months now. And I think it's my new favorite filament. Eson, uh, it's PLA Plus. Yeah, I definitely like PLA Plus way better than like the uh, typical PLA. But uh, the prints are actually incredible. And it's actually pretty strong too. So, and it's actually cheap too on Amazon. Link down below, but it's so I've gone through probably about four four rolls, and before I used to use Inland PLA, PLA Plus, but I couldn't get them anymore. They're they out of stock, so I don't know if it's because of the whole COVID thing. And let me show you real fast how it looks under a light here. I guess I could have brought the uh, offset down a little bit tighter here, but um, this is actually on my large printer too, the large one with a lot of jerk. Um, this this printer bot right here is actually a lot better printing parts because it's smaller, less uh, less jerk going on there. But um, yeah, pretty cool. Pretty happy with it so far. Right, so here's a few more parts I did with the uh, PLA Plus. But look how tight those layers are. I mean that's 0.1 millimeter, but I mean this this filament's awesome. And I'm actually not even printing slowly too right now. Um, but the layers are tight. Really nice. And uh, if you're not familiar with PLA Plus, it's a combination of like between PLA and, and PETG. And for my printers, it's uh, 210 degrees. So, yeah, I'll definitely be buying more of it. So, all right, if you want some, link down below. Or they also have it at Fry's, Fry's Electronics. All right, cool.